So, camp, camp sunshine. What kind of camper are you? Uh, I'd like a challenge. So, kiddo, are you looking forward to summer camp? We're getting close. <clears throat> yeah, I guess so. Hey, we'll have less of that attitude, young man. This is as hard for us as it is for you. Sorry, Mom. You legit just woke up. I'm sorry, Brad. Sorry, Mom. I just don't see why I have to leave all my friends back home. I know it's been tough recently, but I promise you that I'll have everything settled when you get home. Oh, oh man. Uh, oh, John Wolf Live is hosting. Thank you for the rest! It wasn't an easy choice for your father and I to separate. Oh, oh, I'm sorry, really, I am. Oh, definition hosting. Thank you for the host. Oh, man. oh, all the auto hosts are popping up now. Thank you for the host, Dun Dun! Um, yeah, the auto hosts normally aren't supposed to pop up, but I guess they're popping up. I know, Mom. I know you're doing the best for us. What the heck was with that lighting? Oh, look, we're almost there. Let's get you checked in. Hi there, and welcome to Camp Sunshine. Now that you're here, we'd like to go over our rules. We have an open door policy during the day around camp. However, we do lock doors at night for our campers' welfare. We'll do everything we can to make you feel like a ray of sunshine. We want you to be happy here. Just smile, 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 sure thing. I'm a super happy camper. Hey, come on, Jez. Show some respect. Your <laughs> name is Jez. <laughs> oh, don't worry. It's okay. Lots of campers are full of nerves when they first arrive here. Anyway, I think it's about time we showed you to our ca your cabin. Right this way. Is this mom sounds like a slut dilly why? They're getting a divorce, so obviously she might be. And here we have your bunk. I'll leave you in the capable hands of Jack here, who can show you around your space. Hey, good to meet you. I'm Jack. I'll be your roommate for your stay at camp. Let's get your things put away and you can say goodbye to your mom. Okay, baby. I'll see you next week. Promise me you'll try to have fun, okay? I love you. Call me every day. Oh, come on. Bye. <laughs> Stuff goes in the set of drawers here. Anywho, it's getting late, so we should hit the hay. Good night, Jazz. See you in the morning from the Camp Sunshine. Welcome breakfast. Camp Sunshine, Shine, Shine, Shine. Oh, there's a bit of paper in here. Let's take a look, I guess. Oh, look at the old SNES control scheme. <laughs> and if you want to use the keyboard, so flashlight, cancel, interact, run, map inventory, move. Okay. I hope I remember all that. Oh, makes Ugh, it makes absolutely no sense. Weird. Anyway, that's all my stuff put away. Thank you, Caleb Love Life for the host. Good night, Jack. I gotta see you in the morning. I'm gonna make him so angsty. Night. Look at the hairdo. He's a tough guy. <laughs> yeah, seriously, Saul. <laughs> Holy shit! What the hell was that? Ugh! Jack! Are you there? I guess? Creature's just thinking for the host! Oh, look. Your jammies. Oh my. There's blood everywhere, I guess. Fuck. Demonetized. <laughs> um, just to let you guys know, I have played a tiny bit of this, but not much. Just to see how well it ran and such. So, I'm aware of this very opening thing. Suitcase. Let's get changed out of these jammy jams. Jammy jams. Jammy jams. Suitcase, no idea why I only packed one set of clothes. I guess. She thought you were going to be nude all the time at summer camp with the other boys. <laughs> Can't go outside yet. I haven't even found my flashlight. Maybe you should just grab it. You obviously know where it is. Damn, this cupboard won't open. Found my flashlight. Ugh, I guess. So it has a battery charge, it looks like. I gotta get some water. 
my female voice turns you off the bear fan at least. <laughs> Sorry about that. Water. That's it. I got suited and booted. I need to go find a counselor or something. Come here, kid. Oh, fuck. What the hell is that thing? It better hide or whatever. Totally didn't see that. <clears throat> whatever it is, seems tracked to my flashlight. Better be careful, I guess. Where the hell do I find a counselor? Hmm. Sure the counselor hut was around here. Man, better watch my step. I can't make too much noise. Shit. Or something. This is how you're supposed to hide from him? Oh my god, it's close to us all. <laughs> Damn, that was close, I guess. <clears throat> oh, Matt, I guess let's take a look or something. Well, this may not be a one-off game. This is really, really big map. Guess I'll be needing one of these. Just rip it off the wall. <clears throat> what the hell or something? That's half a body, I guess. I need to find some help. Is this game about a rapist? <laughs> she avoids the bear because she's not a furry. He, he, that's Jez, he. Wait, is it a shirt? she? I can't tell if it's a guy or a girl suddenly and now you're confusing me. Oh, anyone here? Maybe you should turn off your light. Oh, there's the other half of the body. There are more. It says, there are more. <clears throat> There's a blood trails leading to the right. Torn page of the test. Let's see what it says, I guess. Something written at the top. It says, find them all. They will stop him. Cremate the memories. Okay, I can't keep the voice up for very long. You must be talking about that weird bear creep. Let's take a read, I guess. 20th June, 1964. What a happy day. Myself and my wife, Wendy, were just have just landed our dream summer job as camp counselors at Big Bear Summer <laughs> Camp. How is that anyone's big summer dream? Oh, God. We're both so excited, and even though we've been driving for hours, we can't wait to see our new home. What's even more exciting is that Wendy has been having little flutters all day, so it could happen any day now. Hey guys, I'm the new camp counselor. I'm super duper pregnant and I may just not be here the entire summer and you might be down one counselor, but there's no reason why not to hire me, right? <laughs> you don't get a job when you're pregnant in general. <laughs> Especially one that takes you away from everything. Uh... I can't believe we're here, Wendy. We finally made it to the Big Bear Lake. I'm so pregnant! <laughs> oh, Jacob, it's fantastic. This place is absolutely beautiful. I know it will be so happy here. You guys aren't moving in. You're counselors. And you're freaking pregnant! Let's get inside, though. It's getting dark out of nowhere just randomly and very quickly. This place is enormous. Can't wait to get started on making it ours. Look, the management even left us a sunshine bear teddy too for our little one. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. How are they getting like a full blown house because they're counselors? That sunshine bear teddy might be important. Maybe I need to find it or something. But not right now, Jacob. It's late. Let's get some sleep because it just became dark. I mean, it's only 12 in the afternoon. We're adults. We gotta go to bed early. Good night, Mom. I love it. That's creepy! That's freaking creepy! Look at his... Look at... Look at his face! I'm gonna get rid of the mouse off the screen. Look at his face right there. This. This. This stare. This stare. Rapist. 
<laughs> oh yeah, it's all husband's got the right face on, I see. <laughs> I love you too. Here's to our brand new home. Sleep. Okay. Freak me out, Rover. Wait, can you hear that? It sounds like it's coming from the island. How how can you tell? Oh. It's like Cthulhu and shit going on right now. Cultists are resurrecting the dead through your baby. Jacob, wake up! My water just broke! High up in the mountains where I'm a camp counselor. Our baby's on the way! Oh my! Okay, baby. Let's go and have our baby boy! What if it's a girl? Just, you sure it's, it's a boy? What the hell? That didn't make any sense or something. Hello, Prince Shadow. But whoever wrote this seems pretty committed. Maybe there's a way to stop this or something. Maybe there are answers in these diary pages. But for now, I need to get help. <clears throat> I don't want to use my... Wait. It's the fire escape room. Thank you for the house, Prince Shadow! Look at all the blood. Oh, okay, so this was my original one. So, which I did, like, nothing in. I wasn't going to stream this at one point, but then I wanted to, sh uh, because I was having problems getting it to stream, and then I managed to figure it out, so. Hmm, this bed really doesn't really look uh, comfortable. I'll need to find a better one to rest in, or something. <clears throat> okay, so... Yeah. Well, if you need the counselors, they're all to the north. What is this? Oh, a set of batteries. So, inventory, batteries, diary pages. Huh, <gasps> locked. Give me the, give me, oh, you can, you can actually pick up the flowers. Wait, why would I pick up the flowers? I can't interact with that. What is that? Why well, am I always checking these that are obviously empty? Because you're stupid. <clears throat> Found some food, no idea how long it's been sitting there though. I'm just gonna ignore the dead person though. I think I'll leave her alone. Hey, what are you doing here? I've scored this place. Get out. Holy shit, you're alive. Are you going to help me? Not a chance. You can be that bear for all I know. I can't trust anyone at this camp. I turned my back for a few seconds and my best friend was gone. Please, let me in. There's a killer out there, I guess trust you if you help me out. I've been working on this organic compound that I think will stop all of this. I found this weird piece of paper at the back there. I know this is going to work. Didn't look like a diary page, did it? Look, let me help you. What do you need? Now that I think of it, it did. Regardless, I need eight more stems of English mace. You've probably seen the white flowers around the camp. Oh my god. <clears throat> Get me those and you're welcome to come into Fort Kickass. Your plant's got blood all over it. Oh, no, man. Can I notice that I have been offline? Oh, you've been offline for a week yet? There's a roaming bear impersonating humans, yes. Found a quarter, now what can I spend it on? Oh, okay. Oh, it uh, tells you what you need. Oh, that's nice. Found nothing. Found the storeroom key. Found a set of batteries. Nothing good on TV. As much as I'd like to sit down on the super bloody couch, now probably isn't the best time. Like, in general, Saul, you haven't been online? Uh, it's not... Ah! <laughs> Those are 
some freaky looking puppets. They look like they'll jump on me any second. Why did I get scared like that? Oh. Oh, I got hurt. I don't think I want to look at these any longer. They're freaking me out. But I, I took damage. How, how do I deal with that? Like, literally, how do I deal with damage? Um... The hell, nothing. Found a set of batteries. Wow, it's a tennis player scratching your ass. <laughs> Wonderful, there's a killer running around, but if you go collect some flowers, you'll be fine. Yeah. This is, this game is about homophobia and not accepting the bear. Yes, that's exactly it. Hey, bye. Oh my god. Found a can of blue rat energy drink. What is that for? A nice jolt of stamina. Another can of blue rat energy drink. Wasn't there food somewhere? Um, yeah, I found food here for your health. Thank you. Forgot about that. But I also had the blue red energy drink anyway, so. Let's see, laundry room. <clears throat> it's a pile of old sweaters, I'll leave it alone. Found some food in the trash can. No idea how long it's been sitting there, though. It's a washing machine. It's mid-cycle, so I'll leave it alone. Why, why, why do you care if it's mid-cycle? It's a dryer. Not much use to me. It's an empty washing machine. I don't need to use it right now. So what? I'm going to have to wash something at some point? Someone's going to be all like, Oh, there's a killer running around, but I need, my, I need this cleaned. I don't think touching that is a good idea. It's a wooden sign with a picture of a ladybug on it. What? Hold on a second. What's this under here? Found an enormous pair of socks. What the hell? What? What? What if I... What? If, why? Why do I need socks? Damn, it's locked. Well, I have the storage key. So where's the storage? I feel like it was that one thing that was... Ugh. Crap. You're not white flowers. It is easier with a flashlight. I don't want to run until I have to. I feel like this is storage. And it's not. <clears throat> well, that's great. Uh, find some peanut butter, put it in sock, fuck that bear. Wow. I feel like I f let's have some fun. No, no. Where do I hide? Where do I head? Here. I can save. <laughs> How do I get my stamina back? <clears throat> 
Oh, I've got to wait for it to come back. Where is he roaming? Oh my god. Help! There's dead bodies everywhere! Finally! They've sent someone to help! What? How are you still alive or something? Have you come about the heating? What? No? Good! Well, I haven't had any heating since I arrived here, and it's just not good enough. Surely you've seen the blood everywhere? Or something? Don't talk to me when I'm talking to you! My parents have paid for me to have this luxury cabin, and all I've seen so far is dirt and grime. I mean, luck. I already have a mattress. Unbelievable. First world problems, eh? It's disgusting. Not to mention that awful welcome note left for me in my drawer. Who the hell writes that kind of stuff? There's mention of Isaac, Jacob, and some weird stuff going on here years ago. Sounds like a diary page or something. Could I have it? Not a chance. Not until you've got the heating working again. Oh my god. Uh, leave it to Beaver. Maintenance man came. Take one look and they walked off so I'm stuck here with no heating. You might have something about the boiler being in the southeast of the camp. Get to it! Wow. What's this? About this? Yeah, I'll go ahead and leave this well alone. Oh my. Fire escape route. Pity there isn't one in case of a crazy bear attack. Oh, what about this? It's empty. <sighs> Literally. Heat. So the bo Oh, there's the boiler room. Why don't I see if I can get to the boiler room? Okay, that's how you do it. Doesn't seem to be a whole hell of a lot going on here. Oh, there's something on the wall. There's no clue to the wall that says toilet seats up forever. What if you put them all down? Oh look, you can fill up the sinks. I feel like there's a secret here. I just don't know it. I wish the bear would kill that person. Look at the purple flowers. No one wants any purple flowers? What does this mean? It's a wooden sign with a picture of a cat on it. Found some food in the trash can. No idea how long it's been sitting there, though. Ah, oh, I totally need to take it. Why the hell is this cabin locked? They said when you got there, they locked the cabins at night. Dummy. Uh, might as well since I'm here. What is all this? Nothing I can do. Can you turn these off? No. <clears throat> Found a can of blue rat energy drink. And this drawer won't open. I wonder when, if they, you can somehow pry the drawers open. Couldn't find anything except for his wallet and a bag of weed. His name was Cody. Sorry, bud. So I took his wallet and his weed. One characteristic you don't want to have in a horror flick is famously to be a piach. Uh, it's true, Don. It's a poster for the Germanator. Ah! Let's have some fun. 
Ow, that's not fair. <sighs> Why does he just pop up out of nowhere? I feel, I feel like these are cheap shots that he's getting off of me. <clears throat> That's what bothers me about it, is they're, they're cheap shots. Poster for sexy vampire kids. I hope the kids from this film turn out okay. Oh my god. Sexy vampire kids. Hmm, it's fire escaper. It may as well just say to run screaming to the door. What the hell is this? Ooh, books. What's this one? Fifty Shades of Off-White? No thanks. Really? Fifty Shades of Off-White? Found some food. No HUD. No! And he's, I think he despawns. Oh my god. So sorry, Jack. He went to the bathroom and he died. Nope, not touch that thing. Last time I did, my cat didn't look at me for a week. I mentioned that Lovecraft had bad movie adaptations. Dagon is a good one. Watch it with some popcorn with Isaac when he got time. Dagon. Where the hell am I supposed to find Dagon, though? Is that really a Chucky doll over there? Can't reach these books. You think a summer camp for teenagers, you make the reading material closer to hand. Oh, there you are. Why? Stop it. Hmm, there's a tag on the doll. It reads, we're friends till the end. Remember, it's a Chucky doll. Nothing on TV, power button's broken. And he keeps on teleporting in here. Are you allowed to link? No, send it to me in a private message on Discord. I'm not stepping on that. Can't believe that I'm rifling through garbage. Gross. Nothing useful in here. You've been doing it the entire time! Oh no. Oh god, I can hear you. Hold on, I'm coming to find you. I don't like that. It just seems like a bad idea. What the hell happened? You still breathing? I need to get you some help. No, leave me, save her. But you're hurt. Leave me, save her. That, that voice is... Who makes a cabin like this? Oh my god. I'm coming, just hold on. What kind of building is this? Exactly, what kind of building is this? Oh my god. She's dead. She's already dead. I'm so sorry. If only this room's hadn't been winding corridors and stuff. Go on, try and get out of here. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Come on, try and get out of here. Oh my god. Didn't see me there, huh? I tripped! Ow, my ankle! 
Nico! No! Oh. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> I like how your character's face when he's talking is like so uncaring. Hey bear, finish me off! Found a diary page, let's see what it says or something. 21st June, 1964. I'm so sorry we couldn't do anything to save her. If only you hadn't been up in the mountains in a cabin, says the nurse off to the side. I mean, it's almost like she took one look at your son and her heart stopped. Nurse Johnson, that is not something that should be said. I'm sorry. I'm a horrible actress, and I've never seen anything like this before. The only condolence we have is that your son is very healthy. You should take some solace in that. We'll leave you for a little while. Again, we're sorry for your loss. Is he just like perma crying? Or is that literally his eye is like blue? Isaac! Oh, Isaac, what are we going to do? We have to stay here for three days so they can teach me how to take care of you. <laughs> Why do I sense no sadness in your eyes? Even though you're a baby who doesn't understand this yet. My beautiful Wendy, I don't know how I will go on without you here. How can this happen to us? To a new family? A family of camp counselors? I promise you I will do everything I can to make sure Isaac is looked after. Let me read this page as someone's getting murdered behind me. <laughs> I'll keep your hospital bracelet close to remind me of you every day. You gave me everything. I love you and always will. Hmm. Why is it that Wendy's hospital bracelet really sticks out to me on this page? Because it's highlighted. I must look after Isaac. Bubby's home! 28th June, 1964. In the name of God, the merciful Father, we commit the body of Wendy Illiman to the peace of the grave. From dust you came, and to dust you shall return. I shall leave you for a moment. Please stop by the church if you would like to talk. <coughs> hey, there's white flowers over there. I need those. My beautiful Wendy, I can't believe you are gone. You were my absolute everything. I didn't know Isaac was actually going to keep getting home early, so I'll probably end the stream in about 20 minutes. I stayed and talked with the priest until night fell. He made me realize that with his mother gone, Isaac will need me more than ever. We're just going to dig her up. Reanimator. That's what the cultists do, right? Anyhow. <sighs> Found some food on this dead body. No idea how long it's been sitting there, though. Why, why do you keep grabbing things off of bodies? Like, it's creepy, dude. Stop it. It's a wooden sign with a picture of a frog on it. <clears throat> and there's a bunny one, too. Uh, during a late night crew, they kept calling Isaac Isaac. I didn't know. Oh, you didn't know he was home. I couldn't find anything except for his wallet. His name was Chris and he seemed like a really cool guy. Y you didn't know any of these people. Shut up, kid. What the hell? Nothing. Found a key with a ladybug key ring. Found some food on this body. I guess it's okay, I'm leaving. So I've got a ladybug key ring. Where's the ladybug on here? That was all the way up on the top left. Let's... <laughs> Are you okay? Let me poke your wound. Let me just poke you. 
Oh my god. <laughs> Wouldn't sign it with a picture of a rabbit on it or something. Oh, it doesn't look great. Why is this one red? Found a set of batteries or something. Damn, it's empty. Not a used tissue in sight. And... Uh oh. Oh, there you are. I heard him. Is he just gonna reappear in here over and over? Empty beer bottles. Guess the camp smuggling rumors are true then. How would you know about camp smuggling rumors? Oh my god. It's so hard to search when he's like right there. Man, I love those films. I hope they don't make any prequels. Damn, nothing here. God. So he despawns, but then he respawns. And in the large houses, he seems to like have a chance of spawning more often. Or at least has a chance to spawn, period. Oh, let me just check. Hang on. I'm not putting my hands in there. Oh my. Hello. You're alive! I've been told you need to fix the boiler. What the hell? Don't start on me, kid! Sorry. Oh, it's okay. I got a little tense when the boiler goes out. Um, yeah, I heard. Can you fix it or something? I can't even open the door to the reset panel. Oh, god damn it. That's the thing. I didn't suppose you'd be willing to go down there and fix it up. I would, but the rats are enormous and be scared of the shit out of me. Me, I suppose so. There's an access letter down there into the boiler. If you can fix the pipes, you can press the manual reset button. Thanks, the man. You'll save my job. I, I, I kind of, I, I was suddenly thinking I need to like, save. There you go, kid. Thank you. I, I, I need to save before I do that. So what's close by? Let's have some fun. Can you, can you not? I know he spawns in here, but is there a bed in here I can use? No. Flower. Mm. I need a bed. He spawns in here too, doesn't he? I think so. Um, look at the basketball court. Get the basketball, everyone. Where am I supposed to go to save? Hello, Janelle. How are you? I haven't been here before. Time for a little nap, I think. Da -da -da. Da -da -da. So, do I want to... Before she tries to kill me because she's staring at a screen like the poltergeist. I'm not going through her stuff without introducing myself first. Why? Leave me alone. You're still alive! How? Or something. Isaac's here. Holy crap, where? No, no, what? Hey, it's not cool. Look, if you see any diary pages around here or something. Nice and talkative, eh? Maybe there's a way I could pull her away from the TV. 
turn off the power. <clears throat> Maybe if I cut these wires, that girl will start staring at stop staring at the TV and talk to me. Were you just in here? Uh, or something, but you seemed really interested in the static on the TV. I don't know what came over me. Sorry for being so rude. Oh, that's alright. I don't suppose you've got a diary page. Oh, I have. I left it in the drawers over there. Thanks. No problem. Happy to help. Now let me see how to get the TV working again. Maybe, maybe not. You're creepy. Leave me alone. Atasaya is almost here. What? Found a diary page to see what it says or something. Hi, Dunce. You want to go camping? <laughs> Which camp would you like to go to? Would you like to go to Camp Sunshine here, or would you like to go to the camp that's very often visited in Friday the 13th? Which I don't remember the name of because I've never really seen it in the movies. Don't kill me. I am back at the camp with Isaac, and the first batch of children have just arrived for the summer. I brought my newborn baby back to camp with me, up in the mountains, because I'm a camp counselor. Just Isaac and I, and we're getting along fine, although I miss Wendy with every fiber of my being. Welcome, campers. We're so happy you're here with us at Camp Sunshine. My son Isaac and I are stopping by every cabin to make sure you're all settling in, okay? He strapped the newborn baby to his back. Newborn baby. Just born, like, yesterday. Remember, tomorrow morning there'll be a fantastic welcome meeting in the auditorium. Please stop by. Any questions? What happened to your wife? Oh. Oh, my. My, sir. That's not... That that thing on your lip. You might want to shave it. Or let it grow more. The time is lights out. Lights out is at 9 p.m. Any more? Do you have extra storage for our pantsuits? Uh, no. Last one. I'm allergic to peanuts. That's not a question, Tommy. Thanks, kids, and I'll see you tomorrow morning. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Everyone needs a mustache like that. Later that night. What the hell is the kid doing? What the hell not again? <clears throat> having ritual dreams has to be the campers messing around he just leaves his newborn son who the hell is making all that racket uh, that's strange what's this book about the history of big bear doing here there's a history book could hold more answers they're all fast asleep this is getting weird I know I've changed his voice Leave me alone, Atasaya is almost here. Creepy girl. Sweet little R&R. &R. This is not going to be a one-off game. It doesn't look like it would take forever to play it if I did it properly, but... I'm I see you. Found some food, no idea how long it's been sitting here yes, though. So no. Fun. Oh my god. Him appearing right there, that was unfair. I swear I've been in a cabin like this already. It wasn't that one. So okay. Now that I saved. I'm not going to mess around. Just going to go to the boiler. Oh, can I touch your wound again? <laughs> What, what is it that he wants me to do? What the hell? 
Oh, dear lord. What? What is that evil sound going on? This is, this is gonna be a horrible puzzle, isn't it? rat hurt me? I don't think it does. The batteries are low, though. Okay, so this is the... How do I get up there? I need to get up there. Well, there's that gray one right there. What if I did this? That, that did it. And there's the blue one. And I have to hit that gray one again. Oh, it's a red one. Is going a little crazy. I feel like I'm gonna die down here. Literally have no idea about boiler maintenance. Maybe this will work. Holy shit, it worked! Hi, Craven. Oh, good. I'm glad you played it because I, I couldn't. <laughs> Now I'll go back and get that diary page. Uh, well, Craven dropped a hundred bits. This is Camp Sunshine. It's, uh... It's, oh, he didn't make it. Holy shit, he got you too, or something. So sorry. It's, a uh, Summer Camp Survival Horror, but it's not very... It's, it's, it's not super difficult right now. I guess you can make it more challenging. It doesn't ask you. I guess the bear pops up more often. It's like some weird murderous bear. And thank you for the bits! <laughs> no Mr. Plot Device. <laughs> Why? Oh man, it got you too. Fuck. What the hell? Nothing. Did you just touch his neck? Oh man. Oh my god. L -l really? It's a green and red striped jumper, a bit tattered and burnt, though. Serious. The door seems to be welded shut. Can I use the computer? Well, the boiler's fixed. So the girl has heat. Yeah, I want to touch your wound again. <laughs> I like how that guy's just permanently dying every time you touch him. Oh, hey, did I touch you? I don't need to do that again, Shirley. I guess I did. Oh. Oh, my. I have to go all the way back to her. 
I'm just... I like how I'm just walking around outside without using my flashlight. I totally can't see everything, and I don't care. There, I used my flashlight. Oh! That was a good thing. Does he ever, like... Let me see, is there anything else around here? Wait, that's not white flowers, is it? No, it's yellow. Eh, my flashlight's about to die. And it's dead. Finally, some warmth, psycho. Now take a horrible letter thing. It's in a cupboard there. Wow. Found a diary page. See what it says. The monsters of bear on the island in the middle of the map is a big paw. <laughs> Here I am at the start of the second summer season at Big Bear. In all, all honesty, it's uh, at Big Bear. And in all honesty, hoping for a normal, rational six weeks. Another year, another set of campers, all checked in. Oh, he's glad to see Isaac after all that work. My one-year-old son, who I've left at home in his crib. <laughs> oh my. Chumana, what's going on? I thought I told you about this mumbo-jumbo stuff. It's like this giant spirit behind her, and he's all like, Stop with the mumbo-jumbo. I am a sorry. I am sorry, Mr. Jacob, as I explained before. I am only predicting your son. There's absolutely nothing to fear. It's not an even appropriate accent, but I don't care. Shut up. I'm not afraid. I'd just rather Isaac not be put through any undue stress. He's been through enough. You just need to stop it. Please stop placing these beads around Isaac's neck. He'll choke! Jumana's beads seem important. Maybe they hold more clues to what the hell is going on. I understand, Mr. Jacob. I'll attend to tonight's menu. We have mutton stew and fry bread. I've actually heard about fry bread, and I hear it's delicious, and it's probably... That's the ugliest baby ever. Good job, Brad. There's my little man. Have you had a good day? At least you look happy. And get out of here, one-year-old. Hello, Illerman residents. Mr. Ellerman, the delivery from the butchers has just arrived. I'll be right there, Karen. Chumana, I have to leave to help out at the camp. See you shortly. She, she's in the kitchen doing more mumbo-jumbo on the kid. A few hours later. I, I, yeah, I don't even know what fry bread is exactly, but I have heard about it. There, that's the sauce done. Now to get the meat I put away earlier. All of this is hard work. We should consider hiring a cook. He's the only counselor at this camp. Like, seriously, how does he make money? I... <laughs> it's so cold in here. What the hell? I just put all this away two hours ago, and now it's completely rotten. Something's definitely wrong. I don't know what you're talking about. What? Where am I? Oh my, where am I? Hang on, what's this? How can a baby move that fast? You just gotta check. This is weird or something! Oh, no, man. Oh, oh, it's Sino Beats is hosting thing for the host! Welcome, Jess. What the hell? Who are you and something and why do you know my real name or something? This is not important. I have summoned you here as we need your help. You need my help. I need yours. Then perhaps we can help each other. We have seen that you are seeking out the diary pages and we wanted to offer our services to stop this madness. We have sensed a dark spirit growing in power. One who will stop at nothing to be reborn into this world. The key to stopping this bloodshed is to discover the diary pages and the items mentioned within them. Uh, is he playing a female or a male? I think it's a male. What is that voice? 
of them. Like the beads that Jumana was wearing? Which voice? These hold memories that this monster simply cannot ignore. We hope that these will ensure the path to its destruction. Once you have found them all, bring them to me so that I can transfer them into their sacred form. This way we can stop this. What? Sacred? Only you can do this. Only a true hero could have survived this long. Take this necklace, wear it close so that we may continue to watch your progress. What the flying fuck is going on anymore? I don't know! But it's broken! Stare into its fractured gemstone for a guiding hand on your journey. Our hopes rest with you. Now return to where you were. There's, there's like, evil summer camp, evil bear, magic. Now I'm back in the bitch's place. Bet! Can't you say I have to organize all my shoes into alphabetical order? My, my flashlight's dead. So here's... <laughs> I'm gonna look up Camp Sunshine and I'm gonna try and see is it a boy or a girl. Camp Sunshine boy or girl. It's it's a it's a boy. The steam the steam page says you play as Jez who's dropped off at summer camp. He awakes in the middle of the night to discover blood everywhere. I'm like, oh So that's a boy. Do I have to get into the middle? Island. There's a swamp to the west, to the right, and to the east, whatever. West woods to the left. Still gotta pick these up. Okay, let's let's make our way. Uh, uh don't step on those. I I'm wondering what happens if I step on those. How much does it alert them? Immediately. So stepping on the sticks is an instant alert. Okay. Yeah, don't step on sticks. Now, inventory. Yup, a trucker. Uh, did I get all of those? I didn't go to the swimming pool and there's one down in the lower left. Actually, there's two I think I haven't gotten. I went in there, right? Yeah, I went in there. Why would you go in the swimming pool? This is a bathroom. There's nothing in here. Oh, she's dead. What the hell? Nothing. You're a waste of space. Literally. Oh, this case is locked and electrified. If only I could unlock it somehow. Uh, oh, there's no way into that corner area because of the gate. Interesting. This looks like something. It's, it's not. Thank you, honey. Isaac's doing some cleaning. I did some more cleaning earlier. He should just relax for a bit. Um, but I'm going to end the stream at 5, which is in about 6 minutes. So I need to start looking for a bed to save at. I mean, I could always go all the way back, but why the hell would I go all the way back just for a bed when I could just keep going this way? Can I, can I get... Oh, white flower. How many of those did I need? Five? I have like three. I have four. I need five or eight. I don't remember. Oh, I passed the fire pit and everything. He doesn't have time to sit down. Oh, there's a burned person there. It's a body that's been burned to a crisp. <laughs> this guy just like murdered everyone. It's all like, hey, you wanna wanna calm down, maybe? Like maybe not. There you are. No. Why does a camp have an electric fence? Don't ask questions. That makes sense. 
Found a key with a cat key ring. It's empty. Suitcase, I bet they won't mind me taking a look. Damn it, it's empty. Why am I always checking things that are uh, obviously empty? It's empty. Oh wait, you can check the bed? I think I'll get some rest.